A new year and a new chapter in lunar exploration. In January, China became the first country to land a probe on the dark side of the moon. It was a far cry from when Chairman Mao lamented that Beijing couldn't even send a potato into space. Since then, China's developed big ambitions to explore the cosmos, and it's become a top priority under President Xi Jinping. The space dream is an important part of China building for a powerful China. With the fast development of the Chinese aerospace industry, the Chinese people will take bigger strides for further space exploration. In 2003, China became the third country to send its astronauts into space after the former Soviet Union and the US. And now the race is on for Beijing to become a major space power over the next decade. It has a very systematic program that is very well financed. It has a, a well-funded program that has many uh, well-defined targets, so they're basically doing this step-by-step and trying to accomplish more and more difficult missions. As it plans to send astronauts to the moon, China's keen to see whether they'll be able to stay there. At this university in Beijing, students have been researching life in a lunar-like environment, with one group reportedly staying in a virtual moon base for a record-breaking 200 days. But while China's made a clear commitment to pouring cash into its space program, some analysts question whether that's sustainable long term, especially as diplomatic and trade tensions between Beijing and Washington run high. The US Congress has already banned NASA from working with its Chinese counterpart over security concerns. Some scientists also worry about China's potential in space, given that it's involved in disputes with other countries here on Earth. I think despite the current conflicts in the long term, uh, international collaboration is a necessity, uh, both because you know, that, that's intrinsically how science works, but also in terms of the budget. Many see both these things as key for Beijing's next goal, getting to Mars. China's already built a simulation base in the Gobi Desert, and aims to send a probe to the Red Planet next year. But while we may be a long way off from landing on Mars, that hasn't stopped China from firing up imaginations. Samantha Vardis, TRT World, Beijing.